Eigenvalues and eigenvectors occur when scalar multiplication, which only shortens or lengthens a vector, is equivalent to matrix multiplication, which distorts some pre-image, here a red circle, to produce a new figure or image shown by the blue ellipse. The first three examples here are not eigenvectors because their image is not a scalar multiple of the pre-image. For example, 0, 1 is not a multiple of its image, negative 2, 4, which is demonstrated by the observation that they are not collinear with the origin. However, the fourth and fifth examples are scalar multiples of their pre-images. In the last case, the image of the point, negative 2 over square root of 5, 1 over square root of 5, is 2 times that point. The scalar, 2, is the eigenvalue, while the point is the eigenvector. It is a known fact that any non-zero scalar multiple of an eigenvector is also an eigenvector, which is illustrated here by the two lines drawn, brown and purple. For another illustration, take the preimage to be the red stop sign. Under the transformation given by matrix A, each point on either the brown or purple lines i.e. the eigenvectors, has its image remain on that line. Not only so, but the scalar distance from the origin will correspond to the eigenvalue, in this case, either 3 or 2. 